Now, anybody that knows me knows that I am a huge Dreamboard fan. Dreamboard is that theming platform for iOS that allows you to radically change the look and feel of your iPhone. And folks, it just received an update. Version 1.1.3 is out, and it's a big change. Folks, this is Jeff with iPhone Download Blog. Like I said, we're going to talk about Dreamboard today. Now, nor normally I don't do, you know, when apps and things are updated on the Cydia store. I really don't go back and do reviews of them. But this one was such a huge, you know, improvement over the previous version that I just had. I just had to bring you these latest changes. Now, look at this change log. Now, of course, the June 15th log wasn't that big of a deal. But look at June 13th. Look at that. New app icon badges, new widgets, new automatic caching. New lock view, dynamic views, actions, functions, variables, Android update, etc. Improved grid performance. So this is a big update. And the big thing about this is that there is now a keyboard in Dreamboard. You no longer have to rely on that, that terrible T9 keyboard that was built in a Dreamboard. Now you have access to the iPhone's actual keyboard. And that makes a world of difference. I'm going to show you here. Now watch how it loads up. Watch how the new Dreamboard loads up. It's a lot more aesthetically pleasing, isn't it? Well, wait until you see the new version of Android, the, the default theme that comes with Dreamboard. Look how that just slides into view. Look at that. That's beautiful, isn't it? And not only that, but watch this. Keyboard access. Yes, the previous versions of Dreamboard did not have a keyboard. You had to rely on a built-in T9 keyboard, which is pretty terrible. So you no longer have to open up Safari and Respring and all that nonsense. You actually have direct access to the keyboard, which is great. And as you can see, it just, it just runs a lot smoother. It's a lot more fluid in its action. Even the apps, notice the app list. Well, anybody who's familiar with Dreamboard in the past knows that this app list was pretty, it was just pretty choppy when you scroll through it. But watch this. Look at that. Smooth as butter, baby. So folks, this is a new dream board and the new Android theme that comes with it is beautiful. Now let's check out some of these options down here. You hit the little plus button, you have your animated weather so you can disable or enable that. I have it enabled, of course. You have editing mode. Now with the new version of Dreamboard, editing mode can be accessed directly within the theme, which is nice. You don't have to exit Dreamboard and then go back in to get into editing mode. So if I just tap that, you're in editing mode and then you can change these icons, you can change these apps to any app you want. So if you want to replace the camera, you just tap it. I want to replace that with Angry Birds. That easy, folks. And then you can fill in these blank spots as well. So to get back to normal mode, you just uncheck editing mode and there you go. So you can launch the apps directly from here. Now, like I said about these widgets, Facebook isn't the sole widget on this Android theme. You tap this, you go to web widget, and look at that. You get access to Facebook, Twitter, and Google search. Now, while this theme is great, what's really exciting about this whole thing, about the update to Dreamboard, is the third-party themes that will come out will inevitably take advantage of the new Dreamboard's functionality. Now, while I've covered plenty of themes in the past, and a lot of them were really beautiful, they were just really good looking, a lot of them suffered because Dreamboard itself just wasn't up to par. It wasn't up to the task of handling these beautiful themes. But now, with the latest update, you know, I think it can handle pretty much whatever anyone throws at it. So folks, we're going to see some amazing themes, and I'm, I'm looking forward to covering them all on iPhone Download Blog. Now, one last thing I want to show you before I go. Look at this. Aha, yeah. We got the lock screen. Watch this. Beautiful, huh? So what do you think about this new version of Dreamboard? I think it's awesome. And frankly, I think it's worth every bit of that $2.99 asking price. Let me know what you think in the comments section, folks. This is Jeff with iPhone download blog.